Hi everyone, in this video I'm going to show you how to make a resume in Word. So actually it is very quick and easy, I'll show you how to do that, but you need to watch this video till the end so you won't miss any important steps. So first of all, we need to access this website called create.microsoft.com. I will leave the link to this platform in the description. The next step, what we are going to do here, is to simply uh, see this interface. And if you scroll down a little bit, you'll find trending searches. As we want to create our resume in Word, we need to select here resumes or simply type here uh, resume. But I'll just simply click on resumes. It will show you different types of resumes available. This is, these are all free templates that you can use and customize by yourself. So you can scroll down and see uh, the template that you like. Moreover, there are some um, filters as well. So for example, there is a color filter. If you click on it, you'll see different colors. So for example, you want your uh, resume uh, to be in green. So choose here a green color and it will show up uh, for you only green color uh, templates that you can use. But I will uh, reset all the filters because I do not want them to be here. And from here I need to select the preferred resume. So for example, I liked uh, this resume, I need to click on it and I will see this interface, new tab. Uh, resume writing checklist. So I have two options. I can customize it in Word so it will open Word online and I can uh, customize this resume on my browser for free or I can download this resume and uh, edit it on my desktop version of uh, Word. So this is uh, on your mind or what you want to do. It depends on you, but I will go to my Word desktop application and see what's going on here. So if you are on your desktop application, you can click here new in the left top corner and here as well, you will see some templates available. As you can see here, uh, you can search for online templates as well, or you can simply click on resumes and cover letters right here. And it will show you different types of resumes as well. Uh, and you can choose here from this list uh, the resume that you like and customize it. But for example, I already uh, created, I already chose a template and it looks like this. So to open this template like this, all you have to do is to simply click on the resume from here that you want, for example, this one, and then click on create. But I already did it and uh, this uh, window is opened. So here you can start customizing your resume. So first things first, we need to change the photo. Uh, to change that photo, uh, all we have to do is to select this photo, then right click on it. From here we need to choose fill, then go to picture. And here we have some uh, several options, so we can choose it from files on our computer, we can use stock images, online pictures, or choose them from icons, but I will uh, choose a photo from my computer. So I have here this photo, it is not me, it's just a simple photo from, um, from internet, but I will use it as an example. But as you can see, the resolution of this photo is damaged, and to fix it, you need to select this photo and go to picture format here on the top side of the screen. Now you need to go for a crop right here, click on the expand button and here you need to choose fill. So now we can adjust our photo so it will fit to this circle perfectly. Just simply drag this photo by the corner and increase or resize or replace the photo. So uh, in my opinion uh, now it looks much better and now I need to simply click out and as you can see the photo is changed perfectly. So now we need to uh, say something about ourselves. So here we have our profile folder, a little section called profile and here we need to talk a little bit about ourselves. So as you can see, uh, there is a text 
that I can edit uh, and uh, I need to simply type something about myself here. So basically I'll remove uh, the entire text. I will uh, copy the text from the AI or, or write it by myself, uh, but uh, I will go back as soon as possible. So now when you created your text or asked AI to help you write a short, brief description about yourself, all you have to do is uh, paste this text right here and here it is. I am a highly motivated and dedicated individual with a strong academic background, etc, etc, etc. It says everything about us and we want to become, in this resume we want to become a doctor, so I will write something about this. So here is the important section called contact. Here uh, you need to um, type your phone number right here. So delete the phone number uh, that is um, in the te template and type your phone number. It is very important. Now, if you have, you can also type here your website. So for example, hello.com and of course your email. So for example, it can be I'll type like this email and then uh, my email google.com. So that is basically how you can customize uh, your resume. Here you can add some hobbies if you want, but I won't add them. You will add it by yourself. Here, of course, you need to type your name. So in my case, uh, it would be Peter. You can drag the text if you want uh, to the uh, upper side, but I will leave it like that. Job title here, in my case, it is doctor, so it would be doctor, so simply type here doctor. Now uh, the education section is coming out. Uh, here we need to type our school name, as you can see in the brackets. So for example, it would be New York High School, something like that. Dates from to, so for example, from uh, 2000, 2017 to 2024 and then you'll need to type something about rewards awards your destination so for example you uh, um you graduated from this school with excellent marks so you need to type something like that basically in the resume you need to type every single good uh, quality about yourself about your words and everything you have reached in your life so here, you, if you uh, study it in uh, university, you need to type here university as well. And uh, of course, some uh, awards get got in the university also. So here is a work experience. Here you need to type something uh, about your past work experience. Uh, for example, you worked in a hospital. So here you need to type hospital, uh, job title, of course, doctor. And here, basically, you need to use some strong words. And as you can see, there are, there are three uh, different points about your work. And in the beginning, you always need to, to type about the best work you have worked for. And in the last uh, part, you need to type about the least preferred work you're, you were working. Because uh, everybody is looking on your on your resume from the beginning and if they don't like the beginning they won't read until the end so in the beginning you need to type something uh, that is most good for you so for example uh, now you need to oh, of course use some words strong words so for example designed discovered created established something like that so for example i will type discovered a new virus so something like that strong words and try not to use some simple words, some weak words, such as uh, associated, helped, something like that, you know. When you are ready with it, you can go for skills. So here is your skills. So for example, you are clever or your IQ is high, so you need to simply uh, type here IQ instead of a skill and you will be able to change it. So you can also change some of these uh, progress bars, but it always depends on your uh, resume and on your personality. And uh, basically that is it. Now all you have to do is to save your resume in PDF format because in my opinion 
this is the best format to use. To save uh, your resume in a PDF format, you need to go for a file in the top left corner. Then here you need to click on the save as, then go to browse. Here choose where to save your file. And from here you need to click on expand save as type and choose PDF and then click on save. And basically here your uh, resume is opened on your browser. You can check it from here. Uh, and basically that is it. That is how you can uh, create a resume in Word. If you found this video useful, leave a like and subscribe to the channel. Thank you.